I drive a minivan. I know, sexy, right? That lot alone will do it for the vibe. That statement in my face now reside on girldontdatehim.com because you know that nigga got that Brady Bunch van and ain't that Brady Bunch in that motherfucker. What are you smuggling? Pesticide? Oh, Orkin van driving face ass nigga. What you gonna do? Rain me? Cause you couldn't pay me to ride around this third world ice cream truck cause that's what the fuck belongs in there. Ice cream, sandwiches, strawberry shortcakes, certainly not a nigga of your stature and your age. Old Jell-O Puddin' Pop face ass nigga. <laughs> and see, I'm no Jell-O Puddin' Pop. I'm an artist and nobody pays me to do shit. So this 99 Ford Windstar is an upgrade from the Nike swoosh and bobos I got on BOGO. You don't even know the trauma one artists and doers on public transportation. Marta got me on medication. This Metro bus situation got me on a propofol drip. So this 99 Ford Windstar is the shit. It gets me from point A to point B comfortably with power sliding doors, rear air conditioning. The safety features are amazing. The safety features are amazing. I repeat this to myself daily because riding around this Scooby-Doo unsolved mystery van shit <laughs> is lame. <laughs> But at least the nigga's safe. And you can't beat that with a stick. But you gotta beat the starter with a stick to get it a start. The engine sounds like Mufasa, Mufasa, Mufasa. You're gonna hear her roar, especially uphill and over 20 miles per hour. The air thinks it's heat, the heat thinks it's air. Mother Nature thinks I'm dead meat. So I'll be that well done beef brisket riding comfortably from point A to point B in this crock pot frigidaire. I might be poor, I might be black, I may even be sweating as to roll down my back, but by God, I'm here. And I've got 99 for a Windstar reasons to be thankful for. Thank you, used car Jesus. Didn't have no job and bad credit, but you didn't let it block my blessing. No, no, no. You said, show me your W-2 and you can get on the first thing smoking. That motherfucker was smoking for real, y'all. But I feel like she's bringing me closer to God every time I'm inside. I'm like, Lord, let there be headlights. And she brings about a lot of negative attention. I got papers saying I can't go within 100 feet of Boy Scout conventions. And the other day when I was getting gas, a sister wife to my Windstar caravan pulled along the side and a sweet lady named Jody asked if I was as excited as she was about the upcoming under eight co-ed spring soccer season. The lightning's going all the way. <laughs> Jody, these may look like mom jeans, but I ain't got no fucking kids. I'm offended. Always come highly recommended whenever it come time for somebody to move shit. You know Jonathan got that minivan, and he ain't got no kids, and he ain't got nothing better to do than move your shit, and your shit, and your shit. I'm sick of this shit. Y'all stop talking about my shit. <laughs>